Hi everybody. Welcome. Day 1060. Uh, I'm going to share my updates with you today. And then I'm going to share something from the heart. So, number one, and then I'm going to let you know how you can enter uh, the contest that I'm going to have this week um, for a stack. So it'll be a nice prize, thanks to Sculpt Nation, and uh, get you guys some supplements. So, number one, uh, my day 1060, I went down one pound to 219.6, back under that 220 again. Um, I worked out tonight, I slept in this morning, which was great. Uh, started off on Monday right with a little extra sleep, and uh, I couldn't wait to then get to the gym after work today. Uh, went and did that. I worked um, back um, and triceps today. So feeling good. Um, enjoyed my workout. And I can't tell you enough. When you find something that can just take you into a happy place, into the zone, into an area that's your safe place, something that you can just relieve your stress, cut the noise out, everything going to the gym or taking time to exercise does that. I would have never thought in a million years that I would be telling you that. I was never that person. I remember when I <laughs> was practically pulled to go try out for the football team. The first thing that I told that coach was, I don't know anything about football and I don't run. I, I, there was no joy in any of that. I'm not gonna say I love running today, but I love putting in the work. I love that I can set a goal. I can go to the gym right now, even at the beginning when I did it right from my basement. I took that time and I went through it and I did something that was for me. So take that time for you. It'll take a little bit to build that routine. Give yourself two to three weeks. Once you do, once you start seeing changes, once you start feeling changes. You're never going to look back other than comparing of the things that you can do now that you could never do then. And you're going to feel a billion times better. Um, so thank you, Vince, for the great workout. As I'm doing Vince's weekly workouts right now, I'm on week, I believe it's four without the legs uh, because my knee is in pain still. Um, but I'm taking rest days and then starting the program early. So I'm on the fourth week um, and enjoying that. I uh, definitely ate my uh, meals from Adam with the meal prepping. And again, I will rave about that chili that I had last night. I cannot wait until this weekend where I have it again. And I'll make that video for you when I do on Sunday. So stay tuned for that. Um, I think the part that I just want to talk about before I get into the, get the giveaway for this week is... I want you to ask yourself one word, one question. Why? I've been thinking about that all day today. I started last night and I just want to get it out so that it can hopefully help you. And maybe this will resonate with others. Why? Why are you here? Probably not for my smiling face. I mean, mom, all right, I get it. You're probably here to see my smiling face, but you're not here just to see me. You're here to see what I can maybe help you out with. Maybe there's something that I can say today that will get you over that, that edge that you've been wanting to do something. Maybe I'm going to give you the magic word that's just going to all of a sudden motivate you. Whatever it is, why are you here? There's a reason. There's something that you want to do for yourself. Or maybe you're just here to win supplements. But if you're not doing something to go along with those supplements, then you're just wasting everyone's time, right? So, why? Why are you here? Why are you doing the things that you are today? I used to ask myself that question, why, all the time. Why did I eat that whole large pizza again? Why did I just say, fuck it, and eat whatever I wanted to? 
and then felt like crap the next day. Why did I hate myself enough to do that to myself? And then it even goes to everything that I've talked about, being kind. Why are you not? Why are we not always kind? It's a choice. You get to choose if you're going to be nice to somebody else or if you're going to mislead them or be rude to them or hurt them in any way. Why are you making those choices? They are all choices. So start making choices that are positive. Ask yourself why maybe before you do something next. It might make you think. So I challenge you with this. From now until the weekend, on Saturday, I will do a drawing for the stack. Choose something positive to do. Do a good deed for someone else. I will also. Do something for somebody else. And let me know what that is. Write it in a comment from now through Saturday. You got this week. Don't think about it too much. But just all of a sudden, one day, when there's an opportunity, there's something. Do something. Or maybe you ask yourself, why? And do something. Everybody, thank you. I appreciate you for being here. I appreciate the support. Be kind. Bye-bye.